Ministry of Health is still sourcing for funds to implement the over 1 trillion COVID resurgence plan. According to the Permanent Secretary, Dr. Diana Atwine, such donations will go a long way in meeting some of the costs of the plan. It will go to fund critical areas that, that are not funded because we have so many unfunded areas. The money will be used to support surveillance and purchasing equipment for some hospitals around the country. As well as in procuring more life-saving supplies like oxygen cylinders, ICU beds and backup generators for the identified regional hospitals in Jinja, Kulu and Kabale. Meanwhile, the Minister for Health, Dr. Jane Rutha Cheng, has handed over two refrigerated trucks to national medical stores. The trucks will enhance the cold chain process for vaccines. Out of the 10 trucks currently available in national medical stores, five refrigerated trucks are due for disposal. Our expectations are that the trucks will be deployed in supporting immunization activities and other health-related activities. They are built uh, to perfection. We worked on the specifications of these trucks together with UNICEF and we are glad that they have come out the way we, we agreed with the manufacturers. These are the initial delivery of two trucks. Three more trucks will be arriving hopefully by September. Uganda, just like many African countries, still relies on donations of COVID vaccines and expects about 1.5 million doses of vaccines, including Pfizer, AstraZeneca and Sinovac, by end of this month. Walter Mwesije, NTV.